there needed to do something to add a little pizzazz to the Chiefs draft this year, picking 23rd player in the first round. Well, it's just not very sexy, is it? Then sure enough, on Monday of draft week, here comes some scribe on the East Coast. Headline reads, Chiefs consider drafting a quarterback in the first round. First of all, that hadn't happened around here for more than 30 years. Anyhow, the headline was nothing but fodder for talk radio. Sure enough, add credence to the report. Some guy from Sports Illustrated has the Chiefs picking Teddy Bridgewater in the first round. That's right. That's not going to happen, folks. The Chiefs have glaring weaknesses at wide receiver and cornerback. Why would they even consider taking a quarterback before the third or fourth round? They gave up two high picks for the quarterback they have right now. Here's what happened. Somebody floats a report that negotiations aren't going so well with Alex Smith, so the Chiefs should go ahead and sleep on Smith until after the draft. There's always a possibility that a quarterback could fall to them in the first round. This draft is already a mixed bag when it comes to quarterbacks. If the Chiefs are smart, they would trade back like they did three years ago. They swapped their number 21 pick with the Cleveland Browns. They picked up a bonus pick in the third round and used it on guess who? Justin Houston. He's arguably the best defensive player they have on the football team. The Chiefs need all the players they can get. They won 11 games last year, but keep in mind they were 0-6 against AFC playoff teams. Quarterback, folks, is not the issue with this football team. They need a burner who can catch the ball and run with it after he catches it. They don't have any of those. Let's hope they get one. That's Jack Smack.